Hello students, uh, let us see this question from just 2020, question number is 6 from part B. So they have given a circuit okay, where two capacitors are connected in series okay, and it's there's a battery of 12 volts and the resistance 6 and 3 ohm also in series. Okay, So now they are asking how much charge is stored in each capacitor. Okay, So let us say uh, once these capacitors become fully charged, okay. So once capacitors become fully charged, are fully charged, okay. Then they will not allow any current to flow, okay. So you can uh, assume they are open circuit, okay. So current I will be flowing only on this direction, okay. Because we want to calculate charge stored charge. So first we should know what is the voltage across these capacitors, okay. So now if I calculate the value of current I, that will be simply 12 upon 6 ohm plus 3 ohm plus this 3 ohm. Okay, so 12 upon 12, that is 1 ampere current is flowing. Okay, and if I calculate 1 ampere current is flowing, so if I calculate the total voltage drop here across this branch, that will be your 9 volts. Okay, the same voltage is getting drop across these capacitors. Okay, so now I can write the V1, V1 is say uh, voltage across C1 and V2 is voltage across C2 and they are equals to now 9 volt, okay. And V1 is a thing that is Q upon C1 because they are in series. So same charge will be stored in each capacitor and this will be your C1 plus C2 equals to 9. Now, okay, so this, this we can write Q uh, say C1, C2 and C1 plus C2 equals to 9. Now you have C1, C2 value 2 and 1 microfarad. So this will give you Q 2 plus 1, 3. Okay. And you have this C1, C1, C2. This C1, C2 value is your 2. Okay. 2 and this is in microfarad, of course. Okay. This is in microfarad. This value in being microfarad here, microfarad 10 to the power 6, 10 to the power minus 6, okay, and that is 9, okay, because if you if you put the values here, okay, if you take here uh, LCM, okay, so this what is Q, so Q take common 1 by C1 is your 2 microfarad, and 1 by C2 is your what 1 microfarad, okay, 9, so. We can take this as LCM. So when this once you take two, so this become one plus two, one plus uh, two, <coughs> one plus two three. Okay, it's correct. So Q equals two. You have a nine. Okay, now nine into two upon three into ten is to power minus six. So this cancel. So Q value comes six microcoulombs. Okay, so because of, so you need to charge this coulomb. So this becomes six microcoulomb. Okay. So six micro coulomb is stored across each capacitor. And this is given as option A, where Q1, Q2 value is given six microfarad and six micro coulombs into six micro coulombs. Okay. So option A is the correct for this solution. Okay, this question. Hope you like the solution. Thank you very much.